That was great. Uh, next person I'd like to bring up is, is Dr. Michael Artman. Uh, he's the pediatri pediatrician in chief chair of the Department of Pediatrics at Children's Mercy Kansas City. Uh, he joined the Children's Mercy in October 2010. Um, he is the Joyce C. Hall Eminent Scholar in Pediatrics. Um, he serves as the Senior Vice President and Pedi Pediatrician-in-Chief. He is a Professor of Pediatrics at the University of Missouri Kansas City School of Medicine. And just because he was not busy enough, uh, a couple years ago he was also appointed Professor and Chair uh, of the Department of Pediatrics at the University of Kansas Medical Center. So I'd like to welcome uh, Dr. Artman. And I guess I would also like to say Dr. Artman has been uh, a great uh, uh, champion and proponent and supporter of uh, weighing in and for the Center of Children's Healthy Lifestyles. And so we thank you for your support. Thanks, Robin. Uh, I just want to take a, a moment to uh, thank you all for being here and, and to welcome you. Uh, it's, to me, this is really exciting to see all of the different uh, groups coming together and, and really taking a, a systems approach at, at addressing this complex and multifactorial problem of childhood obesity and overweight. And it's, uh, this is something that, you know, it seems like we've been talking about this for years. I'm a pediatric cardiologist by training. And I remember when we first started seeing this, uh, this growth and this, the rise in, in obesity rates. And it reminded me at the time of, of what Mark Twain said about the weather. Everybody talks about it, but nobody's doing anything about it. Um, now we're finally doing things about it. And I think it's, it's remarkable, uh, and, and the group that's been assembled here today to, to really uh, begin to come up with some actionable uh, solutions uh, to this problem. It's, you know, there, there are personal factors, family factors, societal, policy, community, et cetera, et cetera. Um, so I, I, I really applaud you for uh, taking this, this kind of uh, comprehensive approach and engaging all these different stakeholders. Uh, just a moment to tell you a little bit about Children's Mercy Hospital. Those that you don't know uh, don't know much about it. It's uh, uh, based here in Kansas City. We've got sites around the region. We're the only children's hospital in a large geographical area. Uh, the next closest children's hospital would be St. Louis, uh, but uh, and that's about four hours away. So I think Children's Mercy is is not only ideally positioned and situated, but I, I feel like we have an obligation to help contribute to solutions uh, to this problem. Uh, Robin mentioned our Center for uh, uh, Children's Healthy Lifestyles and Nutrition, which is really now just under Ann Davis's leadership has really taken off. She's recruited a number of, of stellar uh, individuals and, and those programs are really taken off. Uh, Children's Mercy, we just uh, got the U.S. News and World Report rankings yesterday, and once again, we ranked in all 10 of the specialties. Uh, there's only 23 children's hospitals in the country that rank in all 10. Uh, we had uh, one in the top 10, uh, four in the top 15, and five in the top 20. And we continue uh, to grow and develop our, our comprehensive programs in the, in the region. Uh, so I'm pleased with where we are with our, our children's hospital. We uh, always strive to get better. Uh, working on population health and uh, public health issues is, has become an increasing focus of ours. Um, I'm going to switch gears a little bit and just tell you, those of you who are not from the region, uh, a little bit about Kansas City. Uh, this is a, a hidden gem. Uh, you're going to enjoy your time here, uh, but when you get back home, don't tell people that because we don't want more people. We're just about right where, where we are now. Um, I lived in New York City for about a decade, and uh, coming to Kansas City uh, has just been, it's, it's the perfect city. Uh, we're uh, big enough. There's plenty of things to do. We have a very vibrant arts and cultural music scene. Uh, great restaurants, great shopping, uh, traffic. They talk about rush hour. I, I said, no, you, you have rush minute. You, you, don't, you don't have rush hour here. Uh, easy to get around. People are incredibly friendly uh, and polite. 
Uh, one of the things I learned, uh, I'd forgotten of this, but when you get to a four-way stop here in Kansas City, I, I just go, because otherwise you're gonna be there for 20 minutes, because everybody's, oh, you go. No, no, you go, you go. It's like, uh, so I just, I, I pull out my New York City thing and I just go. Uh, so, uh, Kansas City's a great place, Children's Mercy's a, a, a great uh, children's hospital, and we have a tremendous opportunity to partner together and really begin to make a difference in what we're doing around childhood overweight and obesity. So again, thank you very much, and, and I look forward to hearing the, the results and the outcome of all this. Thank you. Thank you.